Our girls were waking up at as early as four o'clock. We've got girls that are coming from further north than Whangarei, coming to Whangarei to make the van at like six o'clock in the morning. So this season we've got three uh, Northern Raiders girls teams, uh, the 14s, 16s and 18s, and it's really good having them down at the club. Uh, they're bringing heaps of energy and atmosphere down with them, and it's just really good for all the girls locally and for the club itself. Well, there are girls from the team last year. It actually started back in 2021. We took the girls down to the Kōtero tournament with New Zealand Māoris, and once we came back, the girls were still keen to play. We needed some more exposure for the girls, put a call out to the Auckland clubs and Hibiscus made that call and we've been having that close bond ever since. We've got girls that are coming from further north than Whangarei, so we've got girls here from Kawakawa, Moerewa, Kaikohe coming to Whangarei to make the van. It means a lot to our girls to have a competition to come to and we want to keep providing it as long as they want it. Hi, my name's Jay. I'm the junior club captain at the High Business Coast Raiders this season. The actual culture around the club's growing again. Uh, the last few years with lockdowns and distractions and stop-start seasons, it's been really affected, I suppose, the overall outlook of the club. But this year it's really starting to hum again and everyone's sort of starting to come down again. We've got Star of the Month competitions happening and uh, all the parents, kids, coaches and managers are getting behind it. So this season we've had the under seven gala day at the club and it's the first one since I've been up at the coast. We've got Kiwi Tag registration starting to open in the next couple of months so come down to the club or jump on our social pages and get amongst it.